Hey guys, Ben here from Surf Clinic giving you the forecast for this weekend. Um, I kind of waited a little bit later than normal because the forecast has been changing. Um, looked quite nice originally and I would suggest it, but I would keep an eye on it and double check before you come down. Okay, so let's look at swell size first. It's 5 foot and 10 seconds, which is about a 2.5 foot swell. So what's that going to be in real terms? That's going to be about shoulder high maybe shoulder maybe head high on the set it's a southwest swell so it will come straight into the bay so it should be quite nice winds are light first thing in the morning it's only eight or nine mile an hour but the wind pick up as the day goes on so by about six is 20 mile an hour on shore so first thing in the morning saturday looks really nice clean and organized i'd even get down earlier if you could with the tide it's a big big tide so you're looking at about nine o'clock onwards and uh, you can get in the water till about four on Saturday. So small and clean in the morning, show head high, clean in the morning, winds picking up. But do be aware, those winds might not get as strong. So keep an eye on the local forecast. Sunday is a um, bit bigger, a bit more organized. It's six foot, 13 seconds swell. So that means a little bit more punch to the swell. So solid head high consistently, if it all gets in, which it should. Big issue is the wind, light enough first thing in the morning, but then getting strong onshore by the afternoon, getting quite strong by late afternoon. That said, the tide's going to be in by about half four. So again, first thing Sunday morning seems like the best shout. Uh, again, keep an eye on those winds and check out what's going to happen with it. Um, so that's really it. Tide will be on the rocks by about half four. It's a quite busy weekend. This weekend, there's a lot of things going on around La Hinge that might interest you. Uh, the first one is we're running um, beginner and improver and intermediate surf clinics. So what that is essentially is a two-day intensive course, four sessions in the water plus the theory class, which um, gives you some information about how to read magic seaweed, how to read waves when you show up on a beach, um, and maybe some video analysis as well if conditions suit. Um, so that's two days of fairly full-on coaching and um, works out at 100 euro for the weekend so it's quite good we have about three places left so if anybody's interested you can give me a ring um, uh, or give us a shout on facebook or email the other major thing this weekend is that it's the 50th anniversary of the west coast surf club and for a lot of surfers they don't know much about surf clubs around ireland they just come down and surf but the club keeps everything ticking along it's a great voice when uh, what happens generally with clubs is when we need it if something's going on wrong if we need to fight for um access rights for things like that environmental issues like dueling in, in the past here and doom beg the surf club really came into its own it also runs a lot of contests and little programs um for for kids and stuff so it fluctuates up and down on numbers but it's been running for 50 years so this weekend there's a good celebration and they're running their longboard competition so there's a gathering on Friday night in uh, Kenny's. Then Saturday, the longboard comp is on all day. They've got kids, adults, uh, kids, women's, men's, and then my own category, masters, which is nothing to do with skill level, unfortunately. It's just to do with age. Um, and that's on all day Saturday. The beach is open. Contest will just be down the Oluni end of the beach. And then Saturday night, there's um, a gala ball, or there's a ball on anyway in Spanish Point music and so on and a bit of a gathering on sunday so any more information about that if you want to look at the west coast surf club facebook page and um, we'll give you all the information should be a good weekend lots of people around lots of good surfers around a lot of people coming home from australia and around the world um, and all over ireland as well so um a nice gathering of folks and um, so hopefully we'll see you out in the water and have a great weekend